Police at this hour continue to search for the man who robbed a woman at Knife Point as she was leaving her Dayton home. New at 5:30, Jordan Burgess spoke to that woman and has her warning for others tonight. Jordan, that woman who didn't want her face shown on camera says this isn't the first time she's had her home broken into, but this latest incident is by far the most frightening. She says it happened at a time when most of us have our guard down. A routine early morning takes a terrifying turn. As I'm coming back to the house, I'm closing the door, and I feel something on the other side of the door, and the, I'm thinking it's just resistance from the map. Instead, it was a man on the other side of the door trying to force his way inside. After a couple seconds of tussling, he pulled out a knife, and I let up. The man took off, but not before grabbing a laptop. One that this woman needs for school. Papers that I have due, everything was on that computer and now it's gone. She says this is the sixth computer she's had stolen from her. Enough that now she has a camera system to catch the burglars who usually strike while she's gone. It's just the, the mental stress of having to rebuild everything because somebody just wants to take. The woman says you wouldn't think that 6 in the morning would be a time when break-ins are a concern, but now she's warning others to be on the lookout. Just be cautious and be, be aware of your surroundings. Now that woman says the man had a bandana over his face, but she was able to get somewhat of a look at him and give that description to police. Jordan Burgess, 2 News, working for you.